eh, no sé. La verdad es que no me acuerdo bien los nominados de una categor en las nuevas categorías. Pero sé que Jaybreak y Tower de Fun son claros candidatos para ganar. Es lo más probable. Es lo más probable. En estos momentos es lo más probable. Ya, ya llegamos. Por fin. Por fin. En fin. Ahí está David Basuski. Increíble. Ya, veremos. Tremendo, ¿no? Muy tremendo. ¿Cómo está bailando? Momento facha. Está para un meme. Voy a cuántas personas. En la RS no había tantas, creo. Muchas personas, a pesar de, de todo. ¿Va a subir el escenario? No creo, yo soy grande. Hay muchas personas. Eh, no pensé que había tantos invitados pensé, Yo sabía que había Entre 100 y 200 personas eh, A la RS Pero tantos al Innovation de Jaguar No pensé Acá estamos, perfecto Ya wow. inició Estoy leyendo el chat ahí lo ahí está. Yesterday at around 10:02, I said this is arguably the most amazing gathering in the world of creative people. Espérame. And I think it's fair to say right now. Quiero escucharme, pero también quiero que escuchen bien. No sé. Ahí, pero siento que mi voz interpone mucho. Déjame un poquito más ahí. Ahí, creo que ahí está bien, no sé ustedes. Voy a tratar de estar lo más callado posible. So, we're here to honor creativity, innovation, technical prowess, art, design, all these amazing skills that our community so embodies. Uh, we are so proud to have all of you here. The last two days for all of us has been absolutely amazing. Uh, I'm so happy to join all of you. And without further ado, I want to introduce, where is he, the super voice of Roblox, where is Mr. Jay Party? Jay Party! Jay Party, Jay Party! Ahí apareció, Jay Party, era uno de los invitados especiales. This is your pilot for tonight, you are in great hands, Jay Party, take it away. Alright. Let's do this thing. Actually, I'm gonna even give you this mic, Dave. 
Keep that as a souvenir. All right. Friends. Welcome. This is it, the moment you've all been waiting for. I know in your heart of hearts, this year's Innovation Awards at RDC 2022 is awesome. It's going to be an exciting night. We've got special guests. We've got celebrities who may make an appearance. Who knows anything could happen. But I'm going to give you some background. Uh, as you guys know, this is our first time hosting this event live and in person. The Innovation Awards have gone through some other names in the past. For those who have been here a long time, they might remember the very first time we had an award show. I don't even know if it had a name yet. Claro, está diciendo básicamente que por fin estamos de vuelta en las celebraciones en vivo y en persona. Porque recordemos que los vlogs anteriores fueron viéndolos, nomás, desde Roblox, desde Roblox básicamente. So, I know many of you have no idea what you're in for, so this is an exciting night to celebrate your creativity, to celebrate all of you out there, all the work you've done, to celebrate each other. It's an honor to be a part of this community. It truly is the greatest community in the world. I hope you all appreciate yourselves and everyone else in it. This is an incredible experience. So thank you all so much. So tonight we are going to have some fun awards. Están atrasados los, los subtítulos. No sé por qué. Ahí tienen los ganadores. Ahí tienen los ganadores. Esto es muy importante. Ese papel tiene todos los ganadores. Me gusta estar ahí y poder leer esa letra chiquita Cuando le muestra ahí Pero no creo que se pueda ver Habla muy rápido este chabón Don't even say anything different. So anyway, no, I'm thanks to all of you who got the spirit and thanks to all of you for attending in general. We hope you have a good time. Um, you know, without further ado, I think we should maybe we should jump right into it. Should we get to our first award? Muy bien. Jenisa, ¿eh? o sea, eran los ganadores. All right, I'm gonna welcome some staff. Eh, los hitos gratis ya los dieron en el. Cuando tenemos que votar, no, y creo que se pueden seguir consiguiendo. Eh, mi canal tenés un video si lo querés ver, pero. Porque ahí se escucha. No sé, si, no sé si escuchan como dice. The best expression. Bien, acá tenemos los juegos. Acá yo creo que va a ganar Bear Wars o Sonic. Los dos indicados. Sonic. Pet Simulator no creo. Esta vez creo que no. Creo que esta vez va a ganar la nueva experiencia. Este lo va a ganar. Este lo va a ganar. Deep Woken. ¿Cómo que Deep Woken? ¿Cómo puede ser? Esto sí no lo entiendo. Esto no lo puedo creer. 
It's been an incredible journey, and we're game. really looking forward to continuing to improve on the game and make good on all the feedback that we've received from all of you in the months since release. Thank you. Bueno, acá From vemos to musicians to developers, algo que no, no, nadie entiende. Nadie entiende. Nadie entiende. Esto creo que nadie lo 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 entiende. Nadie Best Curved of Direction The Wild West Lo jugué, puede ser Nunca lo jugué, lo quiero jugar Sonaria lo no jugué para un video de tutorial Deep Woken O te haces Deep Woken, esto fue muy raro Por eso no lo jugué Lumian Legacy El Sonaria O Deep Woken Esta, Después de lo que acabo de ver, creo que va a ganar Deep Woken de nuevo And the award for best creative direction goes to. ¿Quién ganó? Creatures of Sonaria. No lo puedo creer. Sonaria. Bueno, es. Muy bien, Sonaria. Como dije. Un juego muy bueno. Pero jugué. La cosa que es tiempo. Todo un juego de dinosaurios. Es el que escucho. And how they could bring super imaginative and creative creature designs to the table. It would also just keep me super motivated and looking forward to the next day. Bueno, lo que vimos en la anterior creo que creo que fue mal. Y Walker no se lo merecía, pero ya fue. Es lo que pasa. Y ahora se viene. We're gonna do something a little different now. As I mentioned, we're gonna do some interviews and have some special guests out here to talk through some fun elements of Roblox and life and beyond. But bueno, acá no es lo mejor. We thought we'd bring out a very familiar face, all of us know and love, from inside Roblox to out. He's been a part of the Roblox family since 2012. He's been a major contributor to the rendering, the physics simulation, multi-threading, and more. He's a man of class, intellect, and general charm. You might know him as Zook CG, but we know him as Arseny Kapulkin. Welcome to the stage, Arseny Arseny. My friend, looking great. Welcome, glad to have you. Go ahead and take take a seat. Make yourself at home. How you feel? How you feeling today? Pretty good. Pretty excited. It's a big crowd, and you know, it is. It's a big crowd. Is this your first uh, late night talk show slash award show? I think so. Yeah. It is. That's good. That's good. We're hoping to have more. I think. Um, I didn't tell you this backstage, but I want to say I love your shirt, and I actually own that shirt, and I saw it back there and almost put it on myself, so I want to say you're looking <laughs> awesome. Uh, thank you so much, Arseny. So, Arseny, you've done a lot of speaking at this event so far. I know your voice might be getting tired. Um, you've had a lot of talks about some of the bigger technical elements of our engine. Um, so tonight I wanted to get to know Arseny the man a little more. Okay. So I went on my computer and I, and I googled the best questions to ask to get to know someone. And so these were the top three questions that I was told we, we would need to ask to really get to know the man behind the keyboard. Well, okay. Who is Arseny? So, all right, let's see if we can stump you with some of these questions. Uh, the first one, Arseny, what is your favorite food? Oh. Okay. I think I'll have to say deep dish pizza. Deep, deep dish pizza. All right. That's not mixed well with the keyboard, but no, no. Other than this, is it's much perfect. Not a keyboard snack. Warning for all of you out there. All right, the next very important question for you, Arsini. Uh, what is your shoe size? <laughs> this is important stuff, folks. We're gonna get to know. Um, so I think these are 46 EU. Uh, I think this is 12 <laughs> <for> <laughs> people. If, if anybody's from right. the US, the EU people are well informed. The Americans, we're gonna struggle with that. It's okay. All right. In the last very important Mucho personal relleno, question, uh, for your answer today, uh, when optimizing mesh que... shaders for an NVIDIA GPU, is number of vertices or triangles no sé more important for no your calculation? No sé qué está pasando en este momento. Mucho relleno. Y no sé qué está pasando. Digamos, <laughs> um, 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 
Personally speaking, I would recommend um, optimizing number of vertices, but okay. you know, since it's a personal question, it depends on who you ask. Really. <laughs> so how you're feeling? Yes, <laughs> the side of the bed you get up on for the day. Right. Uh, well, thank you so much, Arsene. I hope all of you know Arsene a little better out there. Um, so let's actually take a step back. Let's talk a little bit about your time at Roblox. You have now been here for what is over 10 years, which is insane. That's a lot of time. For anyone to have any job or anything, 10 years is extensive. But so I'd love to hear a little bit from your own thoughts, some of your favorite things you've worked on. You've been around here from the long time, from the beginning. What were some of the most creative, fun projects that really spoke to you over your time? Um, if you come to mind, um, I, will, I will name three, I guess. Okay. So I think the first most favorite project <laughs> uh, is um, all of them are my favorite. Yeah, they're all your job. Um, so one of the very exciting things that I worked on was in Argentina. I have a lot of dreams. For many reasons, but one of them is it's like it defined the new type of material uh, or digital matter, as we call it now, that we just didn't have before. Then, of course, Future is Bright. Yes, absolutely. Um, a favorite of amongst everyone. Yeah, as, a, as an um, upstanding YouTuber, it warms my heart that that video is the most viewed on uh, my YouTube channel, so, you know. <laughs> um, and then, of course, I'm spending a lot of time these days on Luau, um, which is also what, definitely one of the highlights. Great, that's awesome to hear. So, thinking about 10 years in the future, what are some of the biggest challenges and things you'd like to solve or work on, and what can we expect 10 years down the road at our next late night talk show slash award show where we'll go through this question. Yeah. So um, maybe one of the biggest challenges definitely is anytime we reach some sort of milestone that is numeric, like okay, number okay. of parts, number of players, size okay, of the okay, world, etc. You talk to Dave, and Dave is like, I like the number that is 10 times bigger than this one. <laughs> OK. And so there are several numbers that are 10 times bigger than the current numbers that are daunting but interesting and so i think yeah, if i look forward that's probably one of the big things you've heard it here folks 10 times the numbers we have now for the future uh so that's very exciting arsene I, I think we're gonna have a little short chat here but anything else you'd like to share with the folks out there anything you're most excited for uh in the future of roblox or just rdc in general or do you just want to say hi mom <laughs> <laughs> hi mom <laughs> very good um yeah i don't know very exciting to um, talk to a lot of people um, today and yesterday. Um, a lot of familiar faces and a lot of new faces. Just can't wait to see. I mean, honestly, um, when I look back at when I joined Roblox, the entire company was smaller than the studios, than the top studios that build content on Roblox today. Right. And it's a little mind blowing, like thinking about the number of people who we get to affect um, right. and you guys get to affect with the work that we do every day. Estoy durmiendo, so, me estoy durmiendo porque esta parte es muy aburrida. Mucho, sí, es mucha razón. Y gracias por joinernos hoy. Un más gran aplauso. Es posible que me duerme. Todo ya. Ahora sí. Bueno. All right, so coming up next no, as a celebration no, of Arsene, no, uh, no, you can no, say here we go. Uh, we're going to be presenting um, the nominees for best use of tech. tech. So without further segundos. ado, oh, no. let's hear no, who they are. Yeah. Best use of tech. Ah, sí. best use of, of tech. Best use of tech. Tunnel work. Muy buena. Ah, lo quiero, lo quiero fácil. VR hands. VR hands. Otro. Front lines. Front lines. Rolling thunder. thunder. Está bien. Juegos que nunca jugué, pero que ahora me dieron ganas de jugarlos. Después lo voy a ver. Guest today, I would love if you could do me the honors of revealing to the world who. A lot of responsibility. It is. I think that's what you're known for, is having a lot of responsibility. Uh, so let's let them know who the winner is. And the winner for best the winner is Tunneler. Tunneler! Tunneler. Sí, este tiene una estética muy linda. Anda a ver si anda en mi, en mi PC, I pero... Hello, I'm Neil, the developer of Tunneler. Thank you so much for voting on Tunneler for an award. It's always been my dream to create an award-worthy game ever since I saw my first Roblox award show. I'm happy to find out it was all worth it in the end. I promise to keep making quality games like this. Thank you again. Bye! Okay, thank you so much for joining me, Arsene. It's been a pleasure. Thanks again, and uh, we'll talk soon. All right, Arsene, the man, him, the legend, the myth, he is real. Okay.
Coming up next, uh, we're going to have a, a, new, a new fun category here. We're going to talk to some of our video stars. So, coming up next is the award for video star video of the year, and we're going to have none other than a video from our very own Sabrina to tell us who it is. So, without further ado, let's turn to Sabrina Bright to hear the video star video of the year. Like any creative endeavor, making videos that are original and entertaining is not easy to do. It requires countless hours of hard work to create something that millions of people from around the world will want to watch again and again. From hilarious antics to jaw-dropping animated films, this next category is a showcase of the videos our community just can't get enough of. Here are the nominees. Video Star Video of the Year. Obvious HD, Stronger. The Bacon Hair. Caro, el que crea las películas. It's Fun A. My One Million Dollar Mansion in Roblox. In Victor. All right, all right. Bueno. How are we all doing out there? Eh, Lina. It's been a wonderful night, and I am Apareció. here in the audience with some Pero of the folks attending seguida. this year's Roblox Innovation Awards. How are we all feeling? Mira, Lina. Good. Very good. good. Great, yeah. great. Everyone's been feeling real good. It's good. I'm scared when someone says not great. Uh, yeah. We'll find out why. Uh, but today, uh, I'm going to get your help a bit, I think. Okay. Talking about our next award. So you just heard the nominees. I think they are ready to find out who the next Video Star Video winner yes. is for okay. this year. You mean to hold the mic? I can yes. help. We didn't. Yeah, we got to figure this out. I can feed you salad, whatever you need. And the winner is the Video Star of the Year is It's Funny. <laughs> Who is that? Congratulations. Yeah, no, wild. Fantastic. Hi, Should we see your video? We are crew. Yeah. We are so honored and grateful to be chosen for a video. Ay. A huge shout out Ay, to all the developers, UGC creators, and content creators. Ah. And to our number one supporters, KF. Thank you. We wouldn't be here without. Thank you, Roblox, for Como video of the year. Oh, Alright, alright. Oh, Thank you me, 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 so me, me, much, everyone, ojos. and thanks for helping me, me, me out. Me, me, well, everyone, the hits keep on coming as we turn to our no, next no, award, and this is no, for no, the video star of the year. No, no, Not to be confused with the video star video of the year, this is the star themselves. No, so please, everyone, no, join me in welcoming no, to the digital stage a star herself, the Queen of Pink, and my former co-host of a previous award show, Leah Ash. And I'm off. Oh, I knocked your phone. Every day, millions of people on Roblox are doing more than just laughing with their friends. They're also watching, listening, and laughing along with their bueno, favorite video creadora. stars. Normal, normal que el video sea creado por esta persona. Video creators who brought us the most laughs, Creo. the most heart, and espero. the most incredible Roblox no moments espero, of 2022. Video Star of the Year. Flamingo. Ahí está, ahora sí. Flamingo, claro, el ganador. It's Funay. Y Funay. No la conozco, no la conozco, pero bueno. Lanky Box. Lanky Box. Para mí debió estar Cristo de nuevo, pero bueno. Lina. Lina. Eh, ha perdido, pero bueno. Lina. Una buena persona. Es argentino. Demuestra todo. All right, everybody. Argentina. You know, there's an old proverb that todo. goes, if you need a good drum roll, do it yourself. So without further ado, país. let's hear my drum roll. All right, I'm going to practice that. But without further ado, the winner of Video Star of the Year is... Flamingo! Normal, Flamingo. Todos sabemos esto. I don't mean to disturb you, but I'm supposed to deliver you this letter. For me? what I do? I won! And I... And I wrote a speech? Thank you so much, and I mean it, for this Creator of the Year Award. Muy bien, Flamingo era normal, pero bueno. Thank you so much to all the video creators, all the stars out there of the internet that make it so vibrant and full of life. And a special thanks to Flamingo and all of you who are nominated. Congratulations for being stars. All right. 
Coming up next, we're going to break into another one of our short interviews to learn more about some awesome creators on the platform. This extraordinary duo established their own studio, built a video empire, and captured the hearts of many all around the world. So without further ado, please give me a warm Roblox welcome to the founders of Wonderworks Studio, Megan and Zach Letter. Most immersed in no me digas que se vino otro pregunta si respuesta porque me voy a morir. Good. Yeah, I'm feeling Amazing, great. Amazing. Yeah. Great. So a little background. Uh, so for the folks out there, uh, no, you are also uh, married. You are running a studio, uh, a business. Mas? You still make constant video content together, and rumor is you still get along. Is that true? Yeah, we uh, yeah. <laughs> we were born in the darkness of working together. Okay. Yeah. We've, yes. We've been able to kind of rise through it mm -hmm. in the very beginning. Awesome. So, so let's uh, let's let the folks know kind of what is your origin story? Where did you two meet? How did you yeah. become the duo? Yeah, we met in 2015 in Galveston, Texas at a gaming convention. I had 100 subscribers, he had over a million. I was way too small for the convention, he was way too big for it. And we just ended up on a panel together and started working together after that. I did some voice acting for him and... Yeah, we recorded history. videos together and then <laughs> eventually became more than friends and started dating, got married, yeah. made a game studio. Have and five here we are. together, so. <laughs> yes, fantastic, fantastic. So with all this you're doing, how do you guys balance this kind of work life uh, of it all? How do you have time for yourselves or do you? Um, that's a tricky question because we just work day and night. <laughs> um, we work all day and then when Zach gets home from work because he works in office, I work okay. from home, that's where my setup is, we just talk about more work. Talking oh. about work? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're passionate about what we do, so like it's kind of just almost our complete life. You yeah, know, yeah. Like making videos, playing games, yeah. making games. What's the it thing? All kind of ties uh, together. If you love what you do, you'll never work yeah. a day in your life. That's what brought us together. Yeah. There you go. Uh, all right. I don't know the concept of this when you can do it all. Some of your individual work here, and you are a major video star. How do you kind of balance that whole persona you have online with who you are outside of that, and how do you kind of shift between it all? I am actually pretty much the exact same person as I am online, as I am in real life. I would say maybe I'm more animated and higher pitched in my videos, but if anyone goes to my vlog channel, they can see the real me, which is the same person, just maybe not as high pitched. Not as high pitched. So when yeah. you create an avatar online, do you create the same thing? Because when you nailed it the first time, why ever change? Well, yeah. That's great. Okay, you, can, you can only be yourself forever, right? Like, yes. It'd be hard to keep something up that's well. not genuine. Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah. And Zach, and you've been working kind of as a studio manager. How has that journey been? I know it's not an easy one to manage a lot of things. Yeah, it's been interesting. Obviously, from being in my bedroom with just like a t-shirt on making videos versus going into the office and having a bunch of people rely on me, it's, it's a lot different. But I think we have a lot of creative and talented people surrounding us, so they make it easy. Mm -hmm. Fantastic, fantastic. All right, folks, so this is going to be a short interview, but I want to give you a chance if there's any final things you'd like to say to the world, anything to promote you're working on, what can we expect coming out here? Last chance for some good words to the lovely yeah. folks out there. Well, we think that this is really cool. Thank you so much to Roblox for inviting us out. Yeah, it's really amazing. There's so many people here. It's so glamorous, beautiful, three-course dinner. Yeah. This was new. This was exciting. Yeah, and, yeah, and we're, we're really excited to like meet every all the devs that we've been talking to on like different social medias and just finally getting to put like a face yeah. to the avatar for the first time. It's been amazing, um, and we're mostly excited for one of our big releases this year, uh, Pooh, a dark, grungy. <laughs> Disgusting horror game. Excellent. <laughs> with your favorite character, Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. We all look forward to Pooh. Yeah. You've heard it here, folks. <laughs> excellent, excellent. All right, well, thank you so much for joining me on stage. Go ahead and hang out for a little bit here as we are going to introduce our next category. And speaking of immersive worlds, this next award is for the most immersive environment. That's Without insane. further ado, let's see who the nominees are for most immersive environment. Most immersive environment. Got it. Vamos que se viene. Interval. Interval. Springs Rock. Springs Rock. Druid's Sanctuary. 3008. All 
right, and it's swiftly becoming our new tradition. Megan, as the guest on the show this evening, yeah. would you do me the honor of revealing to the world our most immersive environment? It's a big responsibility. I know. And the winner of the most immersive environment is... This isn't the right card. This says video star of the year is <laughs> Flamingo. Congratulations. <laughs> As was inevitable at such an award show, uh, happens. we're going to play a little card shuffle. Uh, Flamingo, congratulations again. Uh, very wonderful. <laughs> Put that card away. And now, if the suspense isn't killing you yet, it sure will. Uh, do me the honor of reading this card. Okay, there yeah. You Excellent. Well, you know. And the winner this time of the actual award for most immersive environment yeah, is it. Interval. Interval! Interval. <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you so much. Titanic in a bar. For last year's RDC, we built Interval from scratch in 24 hours, including music, lighting, programming, and building. We focused on immersing our players into this new world we built, utilizing the latest and greatest Roblox had to offer. Finished with our innovative music and visual effect technology to bring it to life. We're so grateful for such high recognition and can't wait to create more for you guys. Thank you. And we are back, folks. I want to thank Uh my guests, Megan and Zach, again for being on the show. And I will help uh, escort you out. Thanks again for being here. You're wonderful participants. It's been great. Thanks for giving Flamingo an extra shout out. Uh, It's great. Um, Okay, folks, our show just keeps chugging along. I hope you guys are ready for the fast paced action that is the flight. And I am your pilot, as you've heard earlier. So. Coming up next is a very exciting segment. We've got a special guest star to present a video for you, and she is my future best friend to tell you about the use of avatar fashion. So without further ado, let's hear what Carly Kloss has to say about best use of avatar fashion. Hi everyone, I'm Carly Kloss, and tonight I am honored ah, to be Kloss. presenting the Genial. award for best use of Avatar fashion. Se viene el the past few months, Tremendo. I worked with creators from the Roblox community Just on viene, our eh? fashion closet, Papa, and, and it was, in, it was truly one of the most inspiring experiences that I've had in my career. The creativity and passion that goes into every aspect of what you all do as creators on this platform mm-hmm. is remarkable. Mm-hmm. And I'm so excited for all that is to come in the future of digital fashion. One of the things I love most about Roblox is that it enables so many different forms of self-expression. With the introduction especially of layered clothing on Roblox, there's even more possibilities for digital fashion than ever before. And so, without further ado, here are the nominees for the best use of Avatar fashion. Best use of Avatar fashion. Mermaid life. Yeah. World Zero. Royal High. Hello, Zing. Gacha Online. All right, everyone, bueno, we are back. And I have a great tradition of reading this card, and so to reenact the award show of old from many years ago, I will officially sit on a couch and read the winner for you all. So, without further ado, the winner of Best Use of Avatar Fashion is... Mermaid Life! Let's hear it for Mermaid Life! Hello everyone, my name is Maesta. I am the game designer behind Mermaid Life. I just wanted to thank the amazing team that designed the avatar for Mermaid Life as well as all of the beautiful fashion items that we provide to the players of our game. And I wanted to thank you guys for nominating Mermaid Life for Avatar Best Use of Fashion this year. We are so grateful to be working on such a wonderful platform and to be nominated for the Roblox Innovation Awards. Thank you so much. Woohoo! All right. Well, Thank you, Anne and Maisa. Congratulations to the entire team of Mermaid Life. You're just so styling. Okay. I've got a couple more awards for you all tonight. Hope you're enjoying the meal. Hope you're enjoying the company, and I hope you're enjoying the fine, fine wines and drinks. So, 
Uh, we've got another very special guest star we're going to cut to on our sat stage over here. And please help me welcome a very fun person. The winner of the 2021 Builder Man Award of Excellence, a man who always looks good in pink. Please, everyone join me in giving him a big ahoy welcome to Minitune! <laughs> Minitune, how you doing? Minitune, yeah. I'm doing fantabulous, Mr. J Party. So Thank you. you look great. You look fantastic. Thank you. You look great yourself. Thank I you. love the suspenders from back here. Thank you. You you free later tonight by any chance? <laughs> yeah. Mini tune, I'll always make time for you. Always time for my favorite tune. Without further ado, you take it away. Gotcha. Well, sitting among us tonight are creators from around the world, from Asia to Europe and the Americas and beyond. But no matter where we come from, we all share some common goal to bring our ideas to life in the most creative and innovative ways possible. The award for best international hit recognizes an outstanding experience created by a developer outside of the United States. Here are the nominees. Best international hit. One. Welcome to Bloxburg. Podría ser. Esta categoría la decidía Roblox. Esta categoría la decidía Roblox. Live Topia. Va a ganar Live Topia. Club Roblox. Yo creo que gana. Los que están participando son muy buenos. Acá no, acá no me sorprendería, no me sorprendería tanto. Que And the award goes sí. to... Esta, esta categoría puede ganar cualquiera. Puede ganar cualquiera porque las... Todas son buenísimas. Welcome to Bloxburg. Bueno, algo esperado, pero tampoco, con los rivales que tenía, con los contrincantes que tenía, Bloxburg podía ser cualquiera. Podía ser cualquiera para mí. Is it hot in here or is it just you guys? <laughs> uh. Este sí, no, este tampoco lo decíamos nosotros. Este Even lo after spending over a decade on Roblox, I can't tell you how amazed I am at the potential there is to innovate. You can invent entirely new genres, dream up vast and expansive worlds, or go wild and make an experience about a diabolical pig intent on chasing you and your friends, because why not? The possibilities are endless. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's why this next award is so special, because it recognizes the studio that has done the best job of harnessing those possibilities and turning them into something amazing. So with that, I'm pleased to present the nominees for Developer Studio of that. the Year. Developer Studio of the Year. Developer del año. Easy GG. Game Fam. El fan creador de Sonic. Splitting Point Studios. Century Games. Ay, que ahora te topia. Bueno, vamos a ver quién gana. And the award goes to. I don't know about you guys, but the suspense is killing me. Developer Studio of the Year award goes to Easy GG. Dos que ganan a Game Fan, pero ganó Creador de Verwas. Muy bien, muy bien. Sí, porque es muy difícil ambientarlo en eh, Minecraft en Roblox. Aunque parezca fácil, muy difícil. No, no conmigo. Thank you so much again, Minitune. Next year you're going to win my favorite tune award. So, big round of again. Thank you to our winners and for Minitune for helping us out. I don't know about you guys. Are your hands getting sore? Your voice is getting hoarse? Uh, well, don't worry. We've only got a couple more awards left. However, the best is yet to come. So once again, we're going to take a slow down, a little pause. And we're going to do one more set of interviews with a fantastic duo of developers from across the world. Yes, that's right, they're from the land down under, down under. You may know it as New Zealand. So everyone, please put your hands together and welcome to the stage our favorite Kiwis, Jandel and Forex. <laughs> So 
glad to have you guys looking dapper as ever. Please. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's nice to be here. Yeah. Glad to be here. We, I think. Bien, momento. <laughs> Recién. Thanks. You know, that might be your favorite favorite table. They got some yeah. big fans. Uh, well, happy to have you. Uh, it's been an incredible run today. Yeah. A fantastic show. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. So I believe now, as I'm keeping track, you might have been the most nominated uh, studio in games for awards Recena, that has not won one yet. Show, no <laughs> yeah. 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 You, right. you understand how Leonardo no DiCaprio saber. feels now. Yeah, yeah. 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 we uh, are nominated for two. Uh, okay, okay, great. great. One zero. So. Yeah, well, uh, <laughs> you, you're just, so far. Yeah, so far. <laughs> Your cheer and excitement is is unrelenting, and I think you're gonna, you're going to take it one of these days. Don't you worry, Leo. Um, anyway, claro, it's been fantastic really to have you on the show, and mejor. we'd love to get to know a little more about Marcelo, you for all the adoring fans out there. <laughs> so I think uh, just for a little history for you folks, uh, Chandel and Forex. I've been on Roblox a long so, time. Yeah, They're working yeah. on some big projects, some small projects, some future projects. You've been accelerators. You've been in the game fun. You do a lot of crazy stuff on your own. You are constantly working around the clock, making awesome things. And I'm sure almost every one of us out there has at least tried some of your content and played some games, some of the experiences you make. So with that, how did you two meet? This this is Jansen's favorite story, so this is good data. So Matt is pretty much the only other developer in New Zealand. There's two others, so there's four of us. And um, I was like, you know what? We're both Roblox developers. So I sent him a message. I was like, hey, let's hang out. And Matt's like, yeah, I've got football training that night, so let's do it next week. Next week was like 12 months later. So he kind of ghosted me. <laughs> Some would say a wise decision. <laughs> And do you regret that uh, acceptance of friendship since? Yeah, yeah. I, I, yes, I, great. I say that, yeah. Yeah, yeah well, he, we're best friends now, so it was his Be loss. Yeah. <laughs> best friends, you've heard it here. All right, and how long ago was this? When did you guys start? Man. Whew. Well, the start of pandemic is when we actually first started talking. Yeah. New Zealand was locked down. Spent a lot of time in, in lockdown together. Okay. A lot of like, uh, yeah, quality time. <laughs> together, I would say it was it was too much time. But, um, quality time. Still getting along. I gotta ask you the same questions yeah. as Megan and Zach, and you're still getting along after yeah. all these projects together. Uh, yeah. Well, maybe once we get off the stage, we'll never see each other again. <laughs> okay. What was the very first project you guys worked on together? Wacky Wizards. Wacky, Wacky Wizards. Wizards. Yep. Yeah. Yes, Wacky yeah. Wizards. <laughs> an absolute yeah, crowd yeah, hit. Yeah, I personally yeah, have enjoyed yeah, it. Yeah, uh, is Cra Wacky Wizards your favorite game you guys have, have worked on? Your favorite yeah. experience overall? I, I think it has to be, yeah. There's it so much to fun to work on, so. It has to be. And you got some new projects coming up uh, in the future yeah. that are going to be kind of big, modern, very big takes for Roblox. Are you uh, yeah. excited? What are, what, is, what are we working on? Yeah, we've been working on Rolling Thunder, which okay. is a game fun game. It's just an FPS game set in Vietnam. It's awesome. <laughs> That is awesome. Awesome. Uh, it's been great to have you guys. Do you have any things you'd like to share with some of your fans, other creators? Any words of wisdom for how you build such exciting, innovative ah, experiences? Uh, what can you everyone else have some of that magic? Yeah, I mean, honestly, it's like, such a privilege to be a part of the community. Like, even being up here is crazy. Like, everyone is so talented in the room. I pretty much just constantly learn off everyone. I feel like a fraud sometimes. <laughs> yeah, you can't be sad about losing awards when like, there's so many people that deserve to win them. So, yeah, if I had to get one piece of advice, just like, Keep making games. If you fail, don't worry about it and just make the next game. Just do what you love. Yeah. Yep. Awesome. You heard it here, folks. Do what you love. Life is always good. Thank you guys so much for having you out here today. Uh, I did have one last bonus challenge question uh, for the two of you. You know, we've heard the word innovation a lot today. Yeah. And I, so I think it's a very important question that I have for you. Uh, and about innovation, Jason, how do you spell innovation? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it. <laughs> no, do it. I, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you don't, don't, you don't give you, it's written on the card oh, I'm yeah. holding. Oh, yeah, E-I-N-N-O-V-A. Oh, that's a tilt. You got it wrong. Anyway, okay. he did his best, everyone. Uh, innovation has a tilt <laughs> built in. Remember that. I spell it R-B-L-X. Um, well, it's been fantastic to have you guys on the show. We need to move things along a little bit. So we're going to talk about the next award here. And this is a very exciting one I'm having you present uh, for me because this is going to be the People's Choice Award. So without further ado, let's see the nominees for this year's People's Choice Award. People's Choice. Adopt me. Adopt me. Bed Wars. Adopt me. Sherry Break. Brookhaven. Deja lo mejor para el final. Pet Simulator bueno, X. Ya parece que va a ser bien. Bueno, yo creo que el ganador va a ser. 
A dormir. Oh, Pet Simulator. Me puede sorprender. Pero para mí está bien. Espero que sea la mejor. Así que bien. Y el ganador es. Bidwars. ¿Quién es eso? Bidwars. Otro más para Bedwars y los creadores. Alright, thank you so much, Chantel and Forks are trying to run off the stage uh, in the dark. Uh, but this is the end of our, our segment. We, I thank you guys so much for being on the show and hanging out with everyone today and sharing some good words. Uh, that is all we have today with Jandel and 4X. One more round of applause. My friends, thank you again for being on the show. Have a good one and watch your step. Um, all right, everyone, let me turn wow, to my trusty wow. note cards. All right, friends, we are quickly approaching the end of our show. We hope the food is good and the entertainment even better. But coming up next, I'd like to introduce la gente eligió, en esta la gente eligió stage, Y creo que yo fui uno de ellos maybe, Yo creo que voté de Edward No me acuerdo bien yo You may know this man as the creator of Roblox As the rock star who entered the show With a sweet, sweet red suit He's Builder Man, he may be your dad But to us, he's our CEO and founder The one and only Builder Man Welcome back bueno, ahí entra de puya, hermano. Otra vez verlo después de los días que vi. Oh, I bet they get that on any second. I can give you this, but it might let's not reach. Yeah, let's, let's see. Let me see this guy. Hello, world. Oh, I can't test. I have a mic. Uh, this okay, is great. We'll keep hanging out. We'll keep hanging. Of use your mic. Yeah, we'll pull this forward as we get to the end here. Uh, we can check on this. Let's see if it's on one more time. I'm going to give it a couple seconds. Sure, sure, sure. I'm assuming right now a sound person is sprinting us another handheld out from the back. The oh, look at the booth is going crazy. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're in it. We're in it. We're in it. Right Builder man, one more time. Okay, so um go a little off script we may have redundancy okay that's all right i'm pretty sure you may be doing a lot of thanks as well at the end they want to hear it they want to hear it all every we're time we're gonna have like redundant thanks for uh the vision of the creation of this show first so the roblox teams that did this this is just over the top like thank you so let's give it up I think you're going to say the same thing, right? Yeah. No, no, no. We're going to mix it up. Uh, okay, yeah, rip off. It's going to be glorious. Yeah. And the, uh, just the Roblox yeah, right community. Yeah, Man, right. you dress up well. Like, <laughs> oh my gosh. It's amazing. Okay, so uh, this year's award, um, are we just, we're just going to show the video of the winner, right? I think I, I do have a, an envelope just for you, uh, as I know would be an honored tradition okay. to have you. So I want to give some background on the Builder Man Award of Excellence. Um, I can hold it for you. Okay, you can hold yeah. it. So, for those of you that were on Roblox 15 years ago plus, you might have remembered the the vision we had in trying to get creation everywhere. So, um, we've been working on this for 15 plus years. The the finalists for this award, I think it took me about a week. To, yes, we had a long back and uh, forth. You're like back and forth. Come on, Dave, because like, it was <laughs> so very, very difficult. And we leaned in to an experience that was both super high quality, super polished, and pushing a little bit of that vision of creation everywhere. So <laughs> I love seeing this. There's a huge future for creation everywhere on the platform. And uh, I think I've said this about 80 times in the show, but it's really like you love all of your children. I love all of the experiences. <laughs> so um, it's super hard. So, okay, so well, should I go through the motions? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You you the motions, I can even open it for you. Yeah. Get the so these results were tabulated by Pricewaterhouse. Yes, that's right. Um, uh, officially compiled, thank you. And so the Builder Man Award of Excellence goes to Starving Artists by Double Bandit Studio. Starving Artists! Woohoo! Really nice. I really liked it. And I believe we have the Starving Artists video to show. Let's see. It. Hey artists, I'm in trance. 
And I'm LA Girls. And we're honored to have Starving Artists receive the Builderman Award of Excellence. Thank you, Builderman, for making this all possible. We want to give a big thank you to our partners, contributors, and our amazing community. We couldn't have done it without you. Growing up in Jamaica, there weren't many opportunities, but Roblox allowed me to turn my dreams into reality, and I hope I can inspire others to do the same. Thank, thank you, you, everyone. Okay, thank you. Okay, all righty. Jay Party, we're going to go back to you as you land the plane All right. on this amazing journey. Thank you, Co-Pilot. stay up here with you. Couldn't do it without you. All right, folks, it is unfortunately that sad time of the evening where we say goodbye to this year's awards and enjoy our food and enjoy the fine evening that lies ahead of us. But first, I do want to say some thank yous to everyone who's been involved in making this dream become a reality. So first and foremost, I do want to call some key players out here. Nicole, we couldn't have done it without you, Nicole. You get a very special first round call out for being the superstar that makes dreams happen. I got a bunch of names here we're gonna name off that are key to making this thing a reality. Rebecca, Kim, Jason, of course, Matt and Neha. I wanna thank the and Tech team, the sound, the lighting, everyone behind it, Jamie and Kelly, you are awesome. Monica and Mark for running around and ensuring that things happened on time. You all have been incredible. Without further ado, I hope you enjoyed today's show. I'm sure you will let us know, because developers, you guys love to tell me what's up, and that's what I love you for. Uh, it's been fantastic. You're the most creative geniuses in the world. Thank you for making this the greatest, most wholesome community who welcomes everyone and anyone and shows we all have the talent to change the world. Remember, this world is yours for the making. Without further ado, folks, this has been the Innovation Awards of RDC. 2022, put it together for all of you, the real winners, the real heroes, thanks to the winners, to the nominees, to every creator out there. Let's enjoy the food and drink. I'm Jay Party. This is Good Night. Genial, nos ponen una pausa. De 30 minutos más, no lo puedo creer. Bueno, parece que ha terminado. Para mí, sí, terminó. Perfecto. Necesito descansar. Me voy rapidito y barato me saldrá. Hoy me voy con... No lo puedo creer. La verdad es que no lo puedo creer. Así que... Así que eso. ¿Algo que decir? De estas premiaciones. Yo nada. Me pareció en cortas. Y no mostraron todas las categorías. No mostraron todas las categorías. Eh, muy raro. Muy raro, la verdad. Eh, no sé. Decepcionante. Ya la vez. Bueno, faltaron muchas categorías. No me gustó tanto. No sé. Faltó, faltó. Faltó. Esto no. Además de horas de re... media hora de retraso. ¿Qué más? Faltaron categorías. Votamos para algo que nunca apareció. Muy raro, muy raro todo. Eh, no sé qué decir. Muy raro. Estuvo muy raro todo. Muy raro, muy raro todo, no, 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 no sé qué decir en este momento. No, no, no sé qué decir. Estuvo muy raro todo. Estuvo muy raro todo. Ah, que decir ustedes, que están acá. Yo no tengo nada que decir. No, no puedo entender lo que ha pasado. Ya me, ya me voy. Me voy, a, me voy a dormir o a hacer otra cosa. No entiendo nada. No entiendo nada. ¿Algo que decir?
parece que nada. Bueno, eh, me voy despidiendo. Eh, voy a dejar esto subido, obviamente, para que la gente que lo pueda ver. Y bueno, no, nos vemos la próxima. Lo voy a cortar encima. Esto lo voy a cortar. Este directo lo voy a cortar. Para que se vea mejor y que dure la hora que tuvo que durar. Y bueno, nos vemos la, la próxima en un video. No sé, cuando ocurra otro evento más. Por cierto, no sé. Bueno, nos vemos la próxima. Que nos veamos. Así que chao.